Yo, welcome back everybody, it's me, Z, and I'm back with another GTA 5 video. Alright man, so we got the first the money glitch wheels? for the new DLC. The um, this is a workaround for the previously patched money glitches. Um, now this glitch is kind of hard with the timing, um, but once you figure out the timing, guys, you should not have any problems with this glitch. Um, also, it does cost about 195000 um, to duplicate a car each time. Um, also, if you got the timing wrong, um, you can cost yourself a couple hundred thousand each time you fail this glitch. Alright, so what you're going to need for this glitch is an MOC with a personal vehicle storage with the car that you want to duplicate inside of it. Um, I recommend duplicating the Retro Custom. Also, make sure you do have a custom plate on the car that you're duplicating. Um, another thing you're going to need is you're going to need a garage that is full and have regular LG stored inside. And what you want to do is go ahead and get a regular LG out of that garage, bring it out, replace over top of it, then make your way inside the MOC. Now, as you see here in the background, this is me failing. And when I failed right there, I actually cost myself 200000 Okay, so, you know, if you guys do not have a lot of money, I would not recommend that you try this glitch, okay? Because it can be kind of hard to get the timing down. You know, but if you have money to burn, uh, then you can do this glitch because after you do it, you know, if you fail four or five times, um, you will get the timing for this glitch, okay? It's very, it's not easy, but like I said, once you get the timing, you will be able to get it. Um, Alright, so I'm just going to show you guys, I'm showing you guys right now a couple of fails. So as you see, I'm ordering my LG RH8 from my garage. And you can go get the LG if you want, or you can drive it out, um, whatever, okay? So you're also going to need a cargo bob for this duplication glitch. Alright, so once you go ahead and get your car out on the map, whether you order it or you drive it out from the garage, all you want to do is just go ahead and replace over top of it with that same type of car. So I'm using the LG RH8, so I'm just going to go to Legendary, I'm going to buy another one, and I'm going to replace over the one that I have out on the map. Make sure you remember what spot that car is from, guys. Okay? Alright, once you do that, all you want to do is go ahead and make your way inside the MOC, and go ahead and get in the car. Okay, now this is the timing, okay? So once you get in, what you're going to do is go to the internet. Once you pull up the internet, go ahead and start holding gas, okay? That's R2 on PS4. Now while you're holding gas the whole time, go ahead and select bay number 3, and select personal vehicle storage, and select empty bay. Now you want to hit renovate, and you want to hover on buy. Now the idea is to quickly hit buy and spam triangle. If you do it too fast, you will drive out like this. If that happens, that's not a problem go ahead and drive the car back inside the MOC and try it again. Now, if you do it too slow, um, you will spawn outside on foot and you would have, you will have to repurchase the vehicle storage, okay guys? Um, so timing is key. If you do it too, if you do it too fast, um, you know, like I said, you, you will spawn out. If you do it too slow, you will spawn out in the car okay so if anything you would want to do it too slow and not too fast you know what I'm saying all right so once you order the car you have it out on the map replace over top of it go inside the MOC get on the internet start holding down the accelerate go to bay number three select personal vehicle storage select empty bay and select renovate and you're, I'm gonna hover on buy okay now the idea is I'm gonna hit X and then quickly spam triangle right after I mean almost immediately the same time you hit X you're gonna be hitting triangle okay that's just X to accept the buy and triangle to close the app okay if you got it right you're gonna see that picture right there and you want to be able to get out basically before he gets out of the car okay so if you got the timing right you will spawn outside on foot uh, you will see that the car is underneath the MOC, okay? So at this time, what you need to do is go ahead and make your way further away from the MOC. All right, and this is where the cargo bomb's gonna come in at. 
and you see I got my cargo bob. Uh, so now I'm going to load up a job, it doesn't matter what job, and then we're going to back out. So all we're simply trying to do is get the car to spawn next to us, okay? Now you have to be far away from the MOC before the car will spawn next to you, okay? Um, also, if your car spawns down at the cargo area, sometimes it does. It does spawn over there and not under the MOC. So same thing, just load a job and back out. Uh, now you're going to need this cargo bob to pick up the car because it will be bricked. Alright guys, um, now like I said man, um, this glitch, the timing can be hard. I use, if I slowed it down, just go back and watch it, okay? As soon as I hit X with my right thumb, I'm hitting triangle with my left thumb, okay? So I'm hovering my left thumb on triangle, I got my right index finger on the gas, and I got my right thumb on X, okay? So I'm going to hit X to accept the buy, and then quickly use my right thumb to hit triangle to close the app okay <clears throat> um, if you do it too soon he will drive out if you do it too late he will get out of the car and you will cost yourself a couple hundred grand all right guys um, so once you have the cargo bomb and the car is bricked go ahead and pick it up all you have to do is drop it and the car will now be unbricked okay once the car is unbricked all you have to do is take it to the garage where you brought the LG RH8 from and replace over the top of that same LG RH8, okay? Make sure you replace over the same one, guys. Alright, now just to show you that we did in fact duplicate a car. Um, and like I said, guys, um, the timing is a little hard on this, I'm not going to lie. It did take me five or six tries um, to figure this out to get the timing and the best way I can describe it is as soon as you hit X spam triangle okay I mean it's like almost simultaneously you're gonna hit X and triangle but you're not hitting triangle or you're not hitting the button to close the app at the same time it's like a smidge off okay almost simultaneously that's how close you gotta hit the buttons okay I can't really describe it any better than that guys um, as you can see here, we got to buy the MLC storage again. Uh, you have to do this every time you want to duplicate. Like I said, if you do not get the timing um, and you spawn out on foot and the car is not under the map, then you will have to buy the, um, the personal vehicle storage all over again and try again, guys. All right, so unfortunately, right now, this is the only money glitch out. So if you can hit it, you know, good, take advantage. Um, if not, then you might want to wait until the next one comes out. I'm sure we're going to have quite a few coming out very soon, guys. All right, so just going to show you here. Um, it, the vehicle storage is full, so we do indeed have our personal vehicle stored in there, and this is indeed the duplicate. All right, so as you can see here, guys, uh, make sure you like this video, share this video, guys. I really appreciate you guys. Make sure you check out all the videos that I put out today. Uh, but that's it for this one, man. I appreciate you guys, and I'm out of here. Peace. Yeah. Uh -huh.